Howdy, you all. Um, I believe today, those who are wanting to participate in cut. Howdy, y'all. Um, I'm not sure if I was supposed to do a video yesterday or today for the health collab. I'm not really sure how involved I'm going to be. I believe just the single requirement is make one video every Monday or every Sunday. I need to go back and watch that video. Sorry, Tammy. Anyway, um, so I'm not going to go through my entire weight drama, lifetime drama thing. Because I, I, I have been overweight since I was a fetus. Um, so, yeah, I'm used to it, but I have lost, um, a little bit, and I want to continue not in a vanity type reason. My surroundings are different today. I'm at my ex, ex's babysitting because the cable guy is coming by, or somebody, I don't know, phone, cable, something, and he needs someone to babysit. And being the overly sweet person that I am. But anyway, that's no other, another story. I can't talk today. It's a Monday. It's a Monday. Anyway, so I'm just going to go right into the stats and what I'm doing. Uh, I hate to cook, so I will not be doing probably any cooking videos unless it's how to fry an egg. Um, so I'm just going to be checking in. And giving my support to those who are also doing this as well as I'm doing so with other people um, outside of inside and outside of YouTube uh, my sets are <clears throat> I'm not sure my arm is getting tired I need to bring my selfie stick today um, uh, my original start weight, and I can't give you a date because I'm not really sure, but my highest weight ever was 353. Um, and that was a while back. And I lost and I gained and I lost and I gained and I lost and I gained. After my open heart surgery, I lost a large amount of weight quickly, although I was pigging out. Don't know why. I guess my body, the extra healing, it needed the extra nutrients I don't know so the weight wasn't staying but um, my lowest weight that I in history that I can remember um, since I've started this way of eating which by the way I'm doing low carb I'm not necessarily following the Atkins diet and I'm not doing um, like keto I'm just watching my carbs I'm diabetic so it helps with my A1C, my blood sugars, and etc. So I'm doing lower carb and um, watching the calories, but not overly watching the calories. Um, but anyway, my lowest was 269 or 268 or 267. I don't remember. I have it down on my phone, but I'm on my phone. I didn't bother writing these numbers down because I'm really prepared every video I make. Um, currently, I've been having some issues, which I mentioned, which I am feeling better. Thanks, everyone, for your prayers and uh, well-wishing. Um, I've uh, had some extra fluids. I've been holding fluids. Um, so I was nearly back up to 300 um, doing nothing because I was barely eating because of this stomach thing I've had. Uh, which, by the way, is better as well. But anyway, um, so I I did not weigh myself this morning because I had to get the kiddo ready for school and then drive into Texarkana. Um, but yesterday I was uh, 279, 278.8, so 279. Uh, my scale is pretty accurate. It's the only scale I go by. My doctor's office scale which I have an appointment tomorrow, I don't even go by. Because I just don't trust any of them but my skill. My skill is probably off from everyone else's. But it's mine. You understand? But anyway, so 
that's the basics and I could have said that in a 30 second video but I babbled on as usual um, but anyway I will I am a slave to the scale and I hate to say it I will hop on and off the scale at least two to three times a day which is horrible because of fluctuation during the day you don't do that people um, I need to just do it once a week like everyone else but my thing is, I'm fine. I'm perfectly fine until the evenings. And I'm talking like 8 o'clock at night. And then uh, it's crave, carb, crave, I don't know, craze, carb, crave, crave, whatever. Anyway, I will, if there's bread in the house, I'll eat it. Any, any carb whatsoever. And I'm not much into chips or candy and stuff. But if that's the only carby sweetie carby stuff I will definitely um, eat it and it will be gone so and there's a few things I do keep in the house because of Sarah I pack it in her lunches and stuff so uh, yeah that's what I need help is in the evenings during the day I'm fine and I'm not a breakfast person I know being diabetic I'm supposed to have breakfast and a snack and lunch and a snack and before bed, a snack. Well, I definitely snack before bed. But anyway, so today is another re 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 restart uh, on my low carb way of life. And I wish everyone the best of luck. I'm not going to make daily videos because there's nothing to really talk about daily as far as weight loss. Um, because with my weight, I know up and down, up and down a couple of pounds a day sometimes or more. Um, just because that's just the way your body holds fluids. You've had extra salt. You've had no salt that day or not much. You, you know, cheated a little bit. You didn't cheat. You, whatever. But one thing I will say is when you screw up, because I have to tell myself this, when you screw up once, twice, or had a bad day, or even a whole weekend, a week, it's not the end of the world. I always had to restart on Mondays. It's like programmed into my head. Everything starts on a Monday. I don't know why. But just stop. Just stop and restart. There's always a reset button. <clears throat> Unfortunately, not in life. Once we're gone, we're gone. But this is only eating. You can always restart. You know? And this is about getting healthy. And a lot of people are doing it. And it's fine. For whatever reason you're doing it. To look better. To feel better. I personally want to feel better. I want my health problems to feel better. I know I've lost a, a pretty good amount of weight. All the doctors say, if you lose a little bit of weight, you're back. And you're this and you're that. I have yet to see improvement in these things. Um, but, uh, you know, maybe someday. I don't know. Not every doctor knows everything. But anyway, um... I want to wish everyone well, and I'm sorry I, I make every single video into a babbling video. If you've made it this far, I don't know why you continue watching. Um, but anyway, God bless, and I'll talk to you later, and I really hope the cable guy comes because I hate being here. Too many bad memories. You know what makes me mad? That's a whole nother video. Never mind. I'll talk to you all later. God bless. Bye.